you there. I want to show you how to search for stock photos and elements using your color palette. So we're going to open up Canva and I want to make sure you know where your color palette is, whatever you're using for your business. Um, and I have one here. This is from my Ava collection from Brand in a Box. It's a brand new collection that we just added. So I want to search for this color. So I'm going to come in here and I'm going to grab the hex code. There's the hex code there. Now I'm going to open up a template. This is the presentation template because I want to add some new stock photos, but that still have that same color. So I'm going to find here, I'm going to find one of the photos. All right, so I've got a photo here. And then if I come over on this left hand bar, find photos, I'm just going to put in nature. And you could really put any word that you want to in there. And then I'm going to hit this rainbow plus button. And I'm going to paste the hex code there and apply. And then I'm just going to hit return. And then all of these images, they all have that hex code color in them somewhere. You can search through and find something that you like. I'm going to try this one. So I'm just going to put that there. And see what I think about having that photo there. And then again, I can change out any of these. Try a different word. All of this is going to pull up different options for you. And once you find a photo that you like, go to this I button and then say add to folder. I have a stock photo folder, so I'm just going to add it there. That way, the next time you want to use that photo, it is in your stock photo folder. Another way I like to use this color search is for when I find I want to find something that has a lot of white space and looks really minimal. So I'll come up here again, search for photos. I'm just going to plug in a white color here. And then I am going to search office, desk. Again, whatever you'd want to search for. And then you can see there's a lot of white space in these images. And when I find one that I like, I just go to these three dots, add to folder, add to my stock photos so that I can use them in the future. Or I click on them and add them to my design. All right. Well, give this a try. It'll help you get your design work done so much quicker. And it will look on brand and really professional. All right. I'll see you next time.